I think selecting India as a destination for, for this trip was, was a fantastic choice um, because it is an emerging country, right? So in every business setting, you know, they talk about the BRIC countries. Um, that's where a lot of the, the growth and the opportunities are. They project that the market size would be about 25 billion by 2018, according to, that was the uh, estimate from P&G. So it is really the place to be for any brand manager uh, and, and any global brand today. It offers CPG companies an opportunity to come in and make a difference and really get in early and say, we want you to trust us as a company and value the products that we offer. When you go there to study marketing, you get all of these fascinating, um, all these fascinating issues that you wouldn't normally have to deal with in another country. Because we have an advisory board that has people who are well placed high up in incredible companies, they open up tons of opportunities for us when we go on these trips. We went to Procter & Gamble, Intuit, Dolby, uh, we went to agencies like Ogilvy & Mather and Millward Brown. When we visited Procter & Gamble they really described um, how they segmented their consumers um, in different tiers, so three different tiers kind of based on socioeconomic demographics and we got an opportunity to, to visit, do in-home visits with, with two of those segments, so a tier one and a tier two. Being able to understand the consumer from that perspective was just a fantastic learning opportunity for us as brand managers or future brand managers that I think um, is really gonna kind of set us apart from some of our peers. You don't get to do that as a tourist, but you get to do that as part of the brand trip. It was a really good balance of um, Again, learning about business um, in a developing country and learning about the culture. We got to go to a lot of really awesome sites in India. Um, we visited, of course, the Taj Mahal. How cool is that? Everyone was so excited to go there. The Taj Mahal, and it's this like grandiose building. And there are lots of other sites that I was not aware of at all that were almost more impressive to me. Things like uh, we visited the Red Fort of Agra. The Lotus Temple in New Delhi. To the gateway of India in Mumbai. But these beautiful canary caves with Buddhist monks. You know you're gonna have a great time and you know you're gonna learn a lot from the different companies that you meet with and the experiences and the learnings that, um, that come from that. You're gonna be able to kind of leverage and, and use in your career and in your personal life and always be able to reflect on that bonding experience. I don't think that you could get that, that kind of insight if, from here in the United States. I mean really going there and seeing it firsthand opened my eyes. It's a very different place to be. It's the place to be if you want growth. Um, it's just a place you have to see for yourself. I felt like I learned way more than I expected that I would and had this immersive, fantastic cultural experience that, you know, it's, not, it's like nothing I've ever done before.